Okay, I'm just making a quick video on how to get into your controller to adjust your settings for high altitude. Works for both 2 kilowatt and 5 kilowatt. I've got a 2 kilowatt, but the, if you have this controller, it's pretty much the same way you go about it. So, okay, if you got this type of controller, what you need to do, top left button first three times. One, two, three. Okay, you got your blinking lines. So you need to get the number 1688. Top right, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 1. Bottom left, okay. 6 is already there. Bottom left, okay. 6, 7, 8, okay. 6, 7, 8, okay. Now first setting is your fuel pump speed. I've got that set at 0.08. So I'm going to stick with that, but you can adjust that for that's your fuel pump speed. Next button you hit again, bottom left, okay, is your top heat, your high speed. 2.1 is what I've got the pump set up. I'm not going to change that as well, but you can adjust that. Bottom left, now your fan speeds. This is your low fan speed and startup. I've got it at 1750. You can change that. Okay, okay, okay. Now here's your high fan speed for your top heat. I've got it at 4,500, same thing, you can change that. I'm gonna leave that. Okay, 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 okay. Now we're off, but, so here's the basic chart that is pretty common practice for high elevation. So this is a good starting point. You can tune it, but this usually gets you pretty close. So if you need to hit pause, go ahead and hit pause on this, and then you can see the RPMs and the pump speed, the Hertz is, is your pump speed and how many pumps it does. There you go. I've had some troubles with this two kilowatt starting a little bit, so I have a feeling the two kilowatts struggle a little more at elevation, but once it runs, it's great heat and they're super efficient, so I'm happy with that.